Here is how you enable beta updates on iPhone. But first, hit the like and subscribe buttons down below. It really helps me out. Thank you. So the first step is we need to open this website, developer.apple.com. We now need to tap the two dots at the top left, and then we're going to select account. And we need to sign in with our Apple account. This is completely free to do. You don't need to be in a paid developer program to do this. Once signed in, there'll be a terms and conditions prompt. Agree to the terms and conditions and you're good to go. Do not select the enroll today. So don't select that option. If you get errors when you try and, you know, sign into the Apple developer, this is because, you know, your Apple ID is either under the age of 18 or you're from the Eastern Hemisphere. So if you can't do what I showed earlier, you will head to account.apple.com, then tap the lines at the top right, and then create a new Apple account. This Apple account that you create needs to be set in the Western Hemisphere region. I would use United States. And then just go through, fill in your details, make sure your phone number is real. When it asks for address, if you aren't using your real address, Google fake address generator US, and then go on the website and just copy and paste the fake US address into here. Once that Apple ID is created, we need to go into our Apple account, which is at the very top of settings. You will need to sign out of your Apple account temporarily. So just tap on the sign out option. Once you signed out, sign in with the new Apple account you created then you should have the beta updates option, update to the beta, and then you just need to remove your Apple account, sign out, and then you should be good to go. Sign back in with your regular Apple account, and that's it.